Whitman made up 53% of voters. New at five for many, going to the salon can be a good excuse to relax, even more so with a glass of wine. Should relax. A state bill approved by the assembly last year would make it easier for salons to provide free booze to customers. The KPI X5's John Ramos shows us some are urging the governor to veto it. I had an email from... When Kara Davidson and Samer Alami opened their 188 men's salon in Lafayette four years ago, they did what a lot of shops do, offered their customers a glass of wine or beer while their hair was being cut. Maybe it's more of a spa-like experience and a lot of people want to go and it, just more than in and out, they want to enjoy themselves and have a good time. But they say they stopped pouring when they found out they were required to have a liquor license. Now they're hoping AB 1322 will allow the good times to flow again. The bill, passed by the legislature and now on Governor Brown's desk, would allow barbershops and beauty salons to serve a free 6-ounce glass of wine or 12-ounce beer to their customers. But not everyone thinks that's a good idea. This protest outside 188 last week was sponsored by a group called Alcohol Justice, headed by Bruce Livingston of San Francisco. There's no license required, so Alcohol Beverage Control Agency is not going to do any monitoring or enforcement of this bill. Livingston says society suffers plenty of problems from alcohol, and the bill would open a wave of new unregulated places where people can get it. We already have 90,000 licenses for alcohol in California. This creates 40, 42,000 new places that serve alcohol. It's just too much. But the salon owners say most operators don't even realize they're doing anything wrong. I don't think this is going to all of a sudden, now that this law passes, you're going to have all these salons start to rethink oh my god, I have to serve alcohol because they never thought they couldn't to begin with. In Lafayette, John Ramos, KPI.